Oh, hello there. Were you watching me the whole time? You pervert. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I will explain to you why I use Final Cut Pro X as my main editing software. So I got my first ever request by Eddie Ghost Pro asking me which editing software is best for video editing. Bro, how should I know? No, just joking. There are many editing software programs out there to choose from. If you are a beginner, I would suggest you use a free video editing software like iMovie or Windows Movie Maker to see what works for you. It's all about finding what you need that best fits your editing workflow. If you are serious about editing, then you should consider upgrading to a pro software like Final Cut Pro X or Adobe Premiere Pro. Those two editing softwares are well known and used by many. It's not too hard to learn the basics of these pro software since you can find many beginner tutorials on YouTube. Now because I work on Mac, I use Final Cut Pro X as my professional video editing software. I can speak from experience that Final Cut Pro X is a very powerful software and is also considered a standard in many studios. Final Cut Pro X comes with a single license payment of $299, which includes all major updates, whereas Adobe software offers a monthly payment subscription. If you use Final Cut Pro X over a couple of years, it will turn out cheaper than Premiere Pro. I especially love the interface of Final Cut Pro X. It's very clean and user-friendly and you can customize the layouts to fit your editing style. It offers a lot of options to organize your media and gives you a quick way to find your files. It supports 4K video resolution and all major raw video formats. There are also a lot of effects transition available, but you also have the option to import third-party plugin. The latest Final Cut Pro update added a color wheel that is really impressive and makes color correction and color grading reasonably easy to do. Final Cut Pro X uses the magnetic timeline which takes a bit time to get used to but if you master it, I promise you that you can save a lot of time and prevent needless mistakes. I personally love working with the magnetic timeline. It's probably harder for experienced editors to switch to Final Cut Pro X coming from a complete different program. So to wrap this up, for me, the best editing software for video on Mac is Final Cut Pro X. As I said before, there are many different editing softwares to choose from, but it's important that you purchase the editing software that suits your need. Do your research and test out trial versions before you make up your mind. Okay, so that's it for today. Let me know in the comment section below with what software you edit on. I hope I could help. If you have any further questions, please let me know. Consider subscribing if you want to see more content like this. My name is Bennett and I will see you the next time.